Ladies and gentlemen, I have some great news for you. Cricket 24 is coming and it's coming sooner than we thought. Cricket 24 is coming in June. As you can see, this is a screenshot of the Twitter page of PlayStation. Cricket 24 coming to PS5 and PS4 in June. Now, don't worry about it. It's not just on PS5. And it's confirmed by Began itself. It's on other platforms as well. And it's on PC as well. I can see here Began confirming that it will be on Steam on day one. Don't worry about it. This is not a clickbaity video. This is real stuff. And has been confirmed by Began itself. And the greatest news as far as I'm concerned is that there will be representation from India for the first time. That means we are going to have the license for some kind of teams from India now, don't expect it to be the national team or the IPL teams because we all know BCCI are pretty uh, old-fashioned about it and uh, don't expect the big teams or big players but there are some kind of licenses from India. It could be club teams, it could be some lower level division teams but it's a great news and a step in the right direction and I just hope that they continue to grow and grow big and studios here. Let's have a look at the features one by one, it's being hailed as the most realistic video game representation of the game of cricket ever with a completely new feeling system which is being hailed as a major, major upgrade over the previous games. I hope they have a new engine as well there. Now, secondly, among the new features promised is enhanced online functionality that is now fully cross-platform so you can play against others regardless of the device of your choice. Now, thirdly, Career mode has been boosted, notably with a full Ashes immersion experience, including detailed cutscenes to put the user into the moment contextually as the Ashes tour progresses, including press conferences, team training sessions and unique commentary. So, as you can understand here, the career mode gets a big, big update which was much needed and it also has an Ashes career mode. So, big stuff happening there in career mode as well. Now, next up, uh, Cricket24 will also introduce Pro Team, where gamers will be able to collect their favorite players from across the world and take to the field with their own Cricket Dream Team, similar to the FIFA Games Ultimate Team. So, if you guys have played FIFA or NBA, uh, you might have already played the Pro Team or the similarly named game mode there where we can play against each other by collecting players like for example you can collect a David Warner you can collect uh, Ben Stokes and you can form a dream team obviously uh, it's going to involve microtransaction uh, if it's on the similar lines like FIFA where you can purchase these players as well to Im improve your team rating and play against each other so we'll wait and watch I'll not talk too much about uh, microtransaction and stuff because it's not yet been officially announced so we'll wait and watch there but it's going to be a, an interesting move and let's see how it works out for cricket 24. next up a bit about the licensed tournaments in the game just like in the previous edition we are going to continue with the kfc bbl and weber bbl tournament that is the men's and women's bbl tournaments that is going to return along with the 100 tournament from the UK. The Caribbean Premier League will also be there and a number of upcoming professional Indian T20 teams. So this is what uh, we talked earlier about licensed stuff from India. This is going to be interesting. Uh, I'm not sure which what kind of teams are going to be there but this is really exciting for me and I'm sure for a lot of other Indian cricket fans as well. Next up the game now features more than 50 highly detailed official stadiums. Now that's also a big boost for this game. As you all know, even though we have people doing fantastic work with stadium creations, playing in officially licensed stadiums is something is something that uh, cannot be you know, replicated by creating stadiums because the feel of the stadiums and everything is is much better and on a higher level when you play in an officially licensed stadium as compared to a created one. Next up, the game gives equal billing to men's and women's cricket and with more licenses added, we'll now have more than 200 players from major cricket nations included with full photogrammetry including players from Australia, England, the West Indies, New Zealand and Ireland with the promise of more to come. That means we can expect some steady updates as well. So we can overall, we can expect some great improvement in the graphics, in the animation and is what I can gather from all this features that are given now i'm going to give you a link in the description you can also see it here but you can go there and and pre-order your game for xbox playstation and nintendo unfortunately no pre-order available for pc steam users but it will be 
there on day one so let's have a look at what this site shows us so you can see here different merchants available here to purchase these games so as you can see it's for ps5 it's for xbox series x xbox one ps5 and down here we have ps4 nintendo switch as well so i'll just show you by clicking first of all go into this eb games um shop and look at the price and stuff so here the cricket 24 for ps5 is available for 99.95 dollar you can pre-order it and there's no date showing here for when the actual release date is so let's go ahead and check out uh the price for xbox one so same price 99.95 dollar for both these games from eb games website now let's check out jb hi-fi and surprisingly the price is just 79 dollar here and you can see for all the consoles like this pcs ps5 xbox series x so the price is 79 and we have a release date actually 30th june so that is when the game cricket 24 is going to be released so go ahead and check this site out and let me know in comment section how you're feeling how excited you are and what do you expect in this game so let me know until the next time it's goodbye from me take care have a nice one